Today we're looking at the Taipan Ariga. Now this is an interesting camper and it's got all the essential features covered. So we've arrived back at site at Dargo and to get the Taipan Ariga set up as you see here, well once you know what you're doing it shouldn't take you much more than 15 or 20 minutes. In terms of construction the trailer is a zinc body on a hot dip galvanised chassis and it also gets a poly block coupling for articulation when you're on the tracks. So at the front of the Ariga you've got this awesome gullwing storage box and uh, look the storage box gets a slide out tray as standard for a fridge, some really sensible storage over there and heaps of uh, jerry can holders, you've got your gas of course and being a rear fold camper you've got a manual winch just to make things much easier when it's time to open up the camper. Now the Arig has got a two pack baked enamel finish and it's done well, in fact it looks really good. It's got independent trailing arm suspension, it's got 120 litres of freshwater carrying capacity, that is heaps for a few days out in the bush. Now the camper also gets a swing away spare wheel carrier. Now inside the camper, just under the bed, there's three 100 amp hour batteries and there's a really good storage in it too. Well, Taipan campers might be the new kid on the block when it comes to Australian camper trailers, but I think we can expect some good things from this company in the future, especially if the Ariga is anything to go by. Look, it's clearly a well-built camper trailer. It's got all those essential features and a few more for awesome trips around the country. Overall, I think the Taipan's a tough sort of unit. It comes in at under $20,000. It's the sort of thing that'll just get you where you need to go. The Taipan's got a few things done to it that really stand out for me for off-road use. One in particular was just the wiring underneath is nice and tidy. You don't see it exposed. Um, it's run through channels and it's out of harm's way. It's a good, solid, honest package. It's not full of tricks and wizardry. It's a good, solid unit that'll take you a long way around this great country. Maybe you might need to add a couple of little bits and pieces and specs to bring it up to a few of the other campers in that price range, but you know what? It presents well, it's got a lot of solid features. It will get you there, it will get you back, it will do it for you in comfort. It's pretty good value for money. Uh, independent suspension, 12 inch brakes, big pull out stainless steel kitchen, fridge slide, pantry, great storage drawers on the uh, driver's side, uh, gold wing box. Uh, other storage pockets here and there, uh, big queen size bed inside, $20,000 off the showroom floor, this isn't a bad package. It's got the core of a good, makings of a good camper trailer here. It just needs a few little touches, but they're easily added. First thing you know, notice about the Taipan, this one comes with a, a dual rear wheel carrier, so uh, give you that ex extra bit of uh, security and peace of mind if you're traveling around. Um, it's a hard floor. Uh, winch assisted opening and closing, uh, it's, it's a good solid offering, a queen size, uh, queen size bed, uh, self sufficiency comes really good, it's got 150 litres of water, it's room for, for two 9 kilo gas bottles so you're never going to run out of gas, and, and room for four jerry cans as well so you're going to carry, you, you can get wherever you want to go and you're going to have plenty of water to stay while you're there, it's good solid all around unit.